good day. Welcome to Shokota Field Foundation Online Training. My name is Oko Peba Marachuku. I'm here to take you on how to make detergents. These are our materials. We have PK oil. We have caustic soda. Our thick ash. Our color. STPP. That is stain removal. These are fragrance. Our sulfonic acid. Our aqua. That is water. Local foam booster and hydrogen peroxide. This is the bucket for the mixing and our stick. Please like and share our videos. We are starting by measuring our water. Okay, so we'll now add our thick ash. Now we want to add our thick ash into the bucket so that we can dissolve it. As you pour, you make sure you stir very well to dissolve everything. Make sure it's dissolved before you add that. Okay, that's it. Now we're going to add your caustic soda. As you add, you stir very well. Make sure that everything is dissolved. Remember, I said that SCPP is our thing to remove Now, you add your ammonia. Remember, I said that ammonia is our drying agent. So, I now add it. It has a very bad odor. So, make sure you have your nose mask before you add. Now, at this junction, if you want to add your color, you can now add your color. Add it, add it into your oil. Remember I said we don't use water-soluble color. We use only oil-soluble color. Dissolve your color inside your oil. you add it you shake it very well shake it very well this is my white color so you shake it very well so that it dissolves add your color together with your oil i want to add my oil At this juncture, if you're adding your oil, you will notice that it's getting thicker. Never mind. We will still detoxify it. We will still dissolve it. 
At this juncture, I want to add my sulfonic acid to detoxify it. You know, it's getting thicker, so I want to dissolve it. It will come back to normal. Note in the charge and clean, it's only one direction is allowed. Only one direction. Don't turn from left or clockwise, please. One direction. Yeah. Add a little of your hydrogen peroxide. A little, not much. Just a little. I said hydrogen peroxide agent, so it will make your detergents rise more before we add our foam, local foam booster. Stir very well. Any of which you added, you stir very well so that it will dissolve and rise. Now I want to add my local foam booster. Yes, to add extra foam to our detergent. Now I want to add my hydrogen peroxide. Remember, we have added a little portion before. Before we add our foaming local foam booster. Now I want to add little by little. And as we add, you keep on stirring. At this junction, this is the actual time you are going to use your leather or tarpaulin so that you put it under. You can see our hydrogen peroxide reacting. Yes. Before you pour the last one, remember you add your fragrance. Yes. Allow it to rise for some time. Yeah, you can see it. You can see it. The reaction taking place. We have put our tapulin on that. But you are, going, you are not going to see it maybe throwing off because our the one we use here is smaller. So if in case if you are doing up to half kg, one kg, it must you must have assets as you try it. So we are doing now for water kg. You can see that our detergent is increasing. I want to add my my fragrance now. Please add. Yes. Our last 
hydrogen peroxide so this is the last junction before we stay it very 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 hard before we stay very hard before boiling into our sapoli you can see a rising process you can see it it's rising yeah once you pour you allow so that it will rise yes the rising process yes so that you get your money after production yes 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 this place the action has started again yeah yes At this junction, you come very well. Come very well. Now, at this junction, this is our detergent. So we want to pour it into our taco bin. But when you pour it, don't stay, don't turn it, don't stir it. Just leave it like that. Leave it. When it's drying, you see a cracky sign of it telling you i am getting dry yes don't turn it don't stay now you know like i said please if you want to make your detergent it's good and it's preferred during the day don't do it in the night or moody time Maybe when sun is not uh, out, do it during the day when the sun is out so that your, your detergent will rise very well. And after you pour it like this, you now leave it inside for that day. Then the next day, you, now, you can now put it outside for sun to dry. You can leave it to dry three to, four, three to five days. You now see and package is ready to use okay yeah thank you very much my name remains Oko Fevo Amarachuku from Potasio Foundation please give it a thumbs up and like our video thank you bye <coughs>